Hello there lovelies, Lavelia Jackson here. Welcome to my channel. Today, we are going to make a DIY party backdrop in balloon topiary. Simple yet very elegant looking. Backdrop. It provides a great, professional looking, a scenery in every event. Use it as a background for photography and party table settings. I am doing a princess tea party for my four-year-old daughter's birthday. She is so obsessed with playing tea party at home. Most of the time is my favorite trick to let them eat their meals. Picky eater it is. Moms out there, you know what I mean. So if you want to learn how to make it, please keep on watching. We need a backdrop stand. Choose a backdrop that suits your budget. Amazon are selling different backdrops, different manufacturers, competing company, ranges $30 and up. All depends if you want the full kit with drapes in it or adjustable uprights. I got mine at online EEI 8x10, a portable backdrop without drapes. Backdrop drapes. Again, Amazon are selling different color drapes. Choose a manufacturer that has a good product reviews in terms of fabric thickness. If you are on a budget and like me repurposing all my buys, well, I bought a tablecloth instead. I got the Lance Linens 90 by 156 at Mix Wholesale. Buy bulk 5 for $64.99. A Valence Scarf Curtain I wanted to create a long swag to my backdrop, making it easy and simple yet with elegance. There are five colors to choose from. Make sure to check out for availability. Safety Pins To hold temporarily the valance to the drapes in the crossbar and the uprights. Pipe cleaner to secure both ends of the valance while making the swag. Iron drapes or tablecloth to loosen wrinkles and fold marks. You can wash it beforehand, then put it in the dryer in low or delicate cycle. Notice I am putting it into my crossbar each time I finish ironing. You still can see wrinkles in the fabrics. You can use a portable fabric steamer so no visible wrinkles in your event. Since I am using three drapes in this backdrop, I use my safety pins to secure both ends to look like one piece. You can measure or eyeball the center of the valance by using safety pins. Secure the middle and place it in the middle fabric to your crossbar. 
take another safety pins to secure it in the uprights. You can pin it to the fabric if your safety pin is smaller, but if you're using the large or jumbo size, there is a slot in the uprights where you connect cross wire to your upright, use that instead. Start pinching fabrics going up, get your pipe cleaner and secure the fabric. Take off the safety pin, adjust the fabric, loosen or tighten with the use of pipe cleaner that has fabric in it. Use the upright slot and secure it. Use that fabric end to hide the upright bar, finishing up the look with some decorations and props. Imagine and be creative. Recycle things you already have. For the balloon to be airy, I got balloon arch, balloon pump, and the balloons at 99 cent store. I filled the base with water, attaching two plastic attachment and a connector. The white sheer curtain, I got it at Didi's a discount store. Insert a pipe cleaner to hold the curtain, leave a little opening for the tube or stand, placing a rubber band or a hair ties to secure it in the stand.
I am using a fishing line to put the balloons together. So there you have it lovelies, our simple yet elegant backdrop and balloon topiary. Remember you don't need to buy everything, use curtains or fabrics you have at home, put them together and if you're on a budget, you can use curtain rods, thumbtacks to secure your fabrics into your wall. Alright lovelies, thank you so much for coming by and checking my weekly uploads. I surely appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Before this video ends or if you like this type of video, make sure to give me a thumbs up, comment down below if you want to see more of my DIYs, subscribe to my channel if you haven't, click that notification bell so you will not miss any of my future uploads. You can always check out my previous uploads, maybe you'll be interested interested too again thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next one bye for now have a happy and blessed midweek everyone mm -hmm.